Yo, what's going on you guys? It's Dr. J. We're back with some more NBA 2K18, my team. And what I have for you guys today is a brand new diamond that I'm about to receive and I'm so excited for it. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have him right now, but I have to wait a few hours to get him. And the player that I'm going to be getting is Diamond P. Mirovic. And the final thing I have to do is earn an Amethyst or higher round prize in my team Supermax. And I've already done the other stuff, but I have to wait three hours because currently, at the time you guys seeing this, um, Season 3, Round 2 is about to end. And it says at the top, 2 hours and 55 minutes. Um, and I'm in the Amethyst tier. And luckily, you know, like, even if I didn't play within the next three hours or so, which I'm probably not going to, it won't de rank me to like the ruby league so luckily I'm, I'm gonna stay in the amethyst tier but i should have been in this tier like a few hours ago because um i was like winning a lot of games but then it would like make me lose right at the end against teams that weren't as good as me it was kind of stupid but it's it's 2k for you like i had so many open threes but it kept making me miss so they like to screw with you but anyway you know we're in the amethyst tier so all i have to do is wait three hours and they'll be able to get my uh diamond Milvik. So I will see you guys there in just a second. Okay, we're back and uh, the time has expired for round two of season three. And so we're going to go over to Supermax and it says next round is in just under two days. And it should come up. Finish the first round of the uh, first round. I thought season. Wait, what? I thought it was the second round. What? Oh, uh, I don't know. Finish the first round of the season three at Amethyst tier and we get 1500. And is it gonna say anything else? Uh, <clears throat> I'm confused, but I don't even know what the reward was for getting for getting the top like pink diamond thing. It didn't actually say anything about it, which is kind of weird. But uh, yeah, we're gonna go. Let's just go to. It should say something in goals, right? Yes. Congratulations, you completed amethyst goals. Now available in the reward queue menu, diamond. Pete Mirovic, dude. I'm so excited to finally get him. I should have had him a while ago, but there was a lot of times that 2K screwed me over, and like I should have gotten it, but I didn't. And you can see right there, Amethyst skulls all complete. We're about to get a brand new diamond, and I'm excited to. Oh, we go to Pax Wards Q. Diamond Pete Mirovic, Pistol Pete, dude. We're about to get. Pete Mavic, dude, I'm so excited. Let's just go ahead and open it up. Oh my gosh. Let's see the blue glow. Dude, Pete Mavix. Oh, I'm so excited. Come on. There he is, dude. Come on. Boom. Pete Maravich, dude, 96 overall diamond. Dude, it's crazy I finally got him. And like I said, I should have had him before, but I, I'm happy I got him now because I haven't completed all time domination yet. So he's definitely going to help me out. And dude, I'm so excited to use him. I've heard that this card is a beast and I've played against him a lot. And he seems like he's a great card. And he can make like all different kinds of shots, you know? But dude, that card looks insane. Pete Maravich, dude from the Utah Jazz. Man, I am so excited. <laughs> All right, let's not waste any more time. Let's go and check out his stats. And then we're also gonna go check him out in freestyle too. Man, Pete Mayovic. He's definitely one of my favorite players from the, uh, uh, probably, I don't know of all time. Yeah, probably all time actually. Um, I, I definitely have a lot of respect for him. He's one of the greatest players of all time. Oh, not all the time. You know what I mean. Ah, oh, dude, I'm, it's two in the morning. I don't know what I'm saying. Dude, look at those stats. Oh my gosh. Oh, he only has two con two contracts on him. That sucks. He has five Hall of Fame badges and 15 gold badges. Dude, that card looks insane. 99 offensive overall and 93 defensive overall. Dude, that is insane. And like I said, he has uh, five Hall of Fame and 15 gold. He has Pick and Roll Maestro, Mid Range Jedi, Acrobat, Tireless Score, and Difficult Shots. And these are just some of the other ones. I'll scroll through them. I don't feel like reading them off. But, uh, <clears throat> man, dude, I'm so excited to finally have this card. It's just going to make my lineup so much better. Dude, look at all those A pluses. A plus for inside, mid range, three point, and playmaking. 
Uh, a for perimeter defense, C minus for post defense, B minus for rebounding, A for athleticism, and A plus for uh, for basketball IQ, potential, and overall. Dude, this is sick. Let's see what else. Standing and driving layup of 98. Post phase in 88. Dude, that's sick. Draw fouls in 94. Dude, that's exactly what I need. Because, uh, you know, to get complete those free throw challenges and uh, and dominations. Uh, shot close 97. Uh, open shots in 97. Look at all those mid just too. Dude, 96 open shot and contestant off dribble 3. That's crazy. Free throw 87. Ball control 94. 97 passing vision. 98 for IQ and accuracy for passing. Now lateral quickness 92. Pass perception is a 91. Steal is an 85. Dude, that's really nice. Defensive consistency is a 90. Dude, this is all these. And he can dunk too, so that's cool. 89 for speed and speed with ball. Uh, stamina 98. Hustle 95. Shot IQ is 98. Reaction time 92 and offensive consistency is a 98. Do all these players always get a 98 offensive consistency? It's weird. And uh, his system proficiencies, I've kind of forgotten to show them in previous videos, but I'll show now and from now on if I remember. Balance is 99, grit and grind 99. Pretty much everything is a 99 except for uh, post centric, triangle, and defense. But like, dude, this card is gonna be good. And I use the balance, so that's gonna be fine for that. He'll be he'll fit right in. So, but dude, this lineup is crazy. So right now we're gonna go and put him in. Actually, you know, we'll go ahead and check him out in the uh, freestyle. So I'll see you guys there in just a second. Okay, we're in the freestyle right now with uh, this Pete Mirovich and A plus for pretty much everything. And he, okay, he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I thought he'd have like some three point, but let's just see how shot is. Okay, hang on, let me. Oops. Come on. There we go. Oh, dude, that's a good release. Can you make it from this far back? Oh, that was late. I still went in. Oh, that was really early. No way. Oh, I was gonna say. Come on. I wanna make some shots. There we go. Dude, this card looks sick so far. Hey, yeah, it's that little dunk too. So, can you just make shots like this all the time? It seems like it. That was too late. I knew it. I gotta get a shot nailed down. At times it's just like a little too slow, but like too fast. It's weird. Okay, so that was a good one. There we go. There we go. Oh, I keep releasing way too early. How's this move? Oh, that was nice. That was a nice move. There we go, dude. No. Come on. In the corner. Nice. One. Let's see how many you can make a row. Okay. I meant to do in the corner. Okay. Starting when I make it. <laughs> Alright. One. Two. Three. Oh, this is cool. That was a little. That won't count because I was in the. Ah, screw it. I don't care. Dude, this card is sick though. He's got a little dunk too, but. How is he, like, his speed? Let's just see. Okay, so he can just do that, but that's not too bad. Yo, pass it for the three. Dude, can you make it from here? Oh my god, dude, that was the perfect release from the from the middle of the logo right there. Hang on. Oh, I was gonna say. And he has a post fade, right? Dude, that fade away was so far away. No way. 
Come on. Oh, dude. Perfect release on a fadeaway. Dude, that's two. Dude, so many greens. Oh my gosh. That should have been a green right there. Too early. Oh, late. Man, I keep releasing too late. There we go. Oh, that should have been a good release. Come on, one more shot. There we go. And can you do fade from like, wait. No way. I was gonna say, oh, that was a good dunk. He wasn't really known for dunking though, so it's kind of like just like his flashy style. <laughs> and one more. Ah, oh, come on, Pete. You know you can make it. I believe in you. That was way too early. Oh, that went in though. <laughs> Dude, this card is gonna be fun to use so He'll be the guy who I need to help make me uh, Complete those three-point challenges and stuff Dude the deep range for the three. Oh my gosh Oops, no, I meant to go right here Dude, that's like three in a row from right there what? Okay, I may have found his, his spot. Dang it, man. That, if I got five, that would have been sick. Uh, whatever. Let's do one more shot from the half court line. He didn't pass it to me. What are you doing? Come on. Let's do one shot. Okay, I think. <laughs> Dude, this car looks sick, though, and I can't wait to use them, and gameplay will be coming soon with him uh but yeah dude i'm excited <laughs> okay so really quickly before i wrap this video up i'll just show you guys what my lineup is looking like and uh currently at point guard i have diamond jojo white at shooting guard we have the new diamond pete mervix at power forward we have uh amethyst spencer hayward at center we have bob love and and amethyst as well and at small forward we have amethyst run our test and then on the bench we have uh, the Tracy McGrady that I pulled, or I didn't pull, I actually sniped him for 60,000. If you guys haven't checked out that video, I highly recommend it. Also, I posted some gameplay of McGrady, and I just realized he went up to 1,000 for his salary cap. That sucks. Uh, man, that's going to be tough. <laughs> but, um, yeah, dude, Tracy McGrady, Fat, Le uh, fat Lever, or Lever uh, Jamal Mashburn, Shreve Hebdo Rahim. Bill Russell, Bruce Bowen, Hoshi Hawkins, and Roy Hibber, and then some of the players on the bench consists of Buck Williams, Byron Scott, Derek Fisher, who I had to just take out now, um, Jason Williams, um, Steve Smith, Jim Jackson, and Bob Dandrix, and Penny Hardaway, and so on and so forth. But dude, uh, you know, actually, I, th I feel like I should put McGrady at the, you know, at this spot, because... Artest is 6'6", six, six, he's 6'8". Six, so, like, I mean, I guess, like, Artest could be my, like, backup shooting guard. Or Mashman. Oh, Mashman's 6'8", so I guess he'll do that. Uh, maybe I'll do that for now. Because I do like the McGrady more, to be honest. Oh, his, his thing does go down to a 97, though. But, unless... Doesn't matter if it changes up here. Okay, keeps it there, but, like, it's not really any point because... I mean, 97 is still like amazing, you know. But dude, this lineup is looking amazing though, and pretty soon I'll be able to have uh, that um, diamond um, that I get from completing Supermax. Oops, I accidentally switched lineups. Um, but yeah, once I get that, I'll probably be taking the West Huncel. So even though he's a center, um, I'll probably play him at small forward because eventually I'll be getting like other better centers and power forwards and stuff. So. Plus he's like 6'7", so he can go small forward too, so. But dude, for now, I'm just so excited I got this lineup. And like I said before um, in my previous T-Mac video, um, I haven't, uh, I'm not sure if I'm gonna sell him yet because this price is like still pretty valuable right now. 
So I'll check him out right now, see what he's going for. Let me do Amethyst, Rockets, and let's see. So like currently, this has like just under uh, two hours left, and it's at 320,000. And these also are going for super expensive, you know? So, you know, I think I'm gonna maybe see just how his value goes. Um, but for now, I'm gonna keep him because he actually is a really good card, so. But eventually, I will sell him, you know, because like, that's like a really big profit right there. But uh, yeah, that's gonna wrap this video up, you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, me getting this Diamond P. Mervix, and here's one more look at him. And I can't wait to use him. If you guys um, don't have him, I highly recommend it because he's gonna be a really good card to use. But uh, but yeah, that's gonna wrap this up. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching, you guys. There'll be more coming soon. And until next time, later, peeps. Oh, and yeah, be sure to follow me on Twitter at DrJ24 gave me to keep writing posts. And be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel to keep up more NBA 2K18, Call of Duty, GTA 5, and Star Wars Battlefront 2 as well. Later, peeps.